Hello everybody, I'm 8 Buggy, and welcome back to some more Resident Evil 3. Okay, so where we left off, we're playing as uh, Carlos now. For some reason, I keep calling him Marcus, I don't know why. But uh, now we're playing as Carlos. We recently got off the train station, where Nemesis recently struck again. And this time, he took out one of the Russian leaders of the operation. Oh god. Oh no. Alright, so I'm wearing this mask as a precaution because of the virus. And I'm not looking to catch anything. Especially feelings. Brad, stop! T. What? <clears throat> what? What's going on? Come on, man. Not you too. Oh, it's more of it! <gasps> no, it's Brad! I'm sorry. Sorry. What? <laughs> It talked to him! It spoke! Shit! It's locked! Oh my god. You stay on the door. I got this fucker. This fucker is Brad. Go Don't... Get some. Oh, he's gonna make me do it? I'm sorry, Brad. I'm sorry, man. It's open. You are a good guy. You saved us. These stars. That could be useful. Oh man, that really sucks, dude. But hey, Marvin's back. <gasps> Yo, look what it is. We're in the police station. Go. Don't know. Don't care. We got a job to do. So Where right now, as we speak, in, in the star's office. Let's find him and take him into custody. Custody? I thought this was a rescue. So Come right look. now, take I'm. Take a look at this. Okay, I've I... located the star's office. Shut up! I'm trying to fanboy over this. So as we speak, right Carlos, now, get your ass over here. You want to wait until I talk to my audience? Right now, as we speak, Leon could be in this building, in the police department. Mr. X, from the second one, could already be roaming around right now. Oh, I am, oh, I am just fanboying so hard right now. Remember, Bard had access to Umbrella's darkest secrets. He knows we'll try to keep him under our thumbs. So this search and rescue mission is really more like find and detain. Hmm, right. Good to know. I'll open the shutter so you can get through. You stay here and find out what's been going on here at the station. Call you if I find anything. I wonder if I'll see Leon. Hey! Be careful. Yeah. You too, man. Alright. I like how we're running like uh, Chris Redfield from Resident Evil 5. With the gun up in the air like that. Oh, man. I really, uh... I really like this. I like this a lot. Okay, so that worked. Leave me alone. I'm trying to find Marvin. September 16th, 1998. Each member of the force has been issued an ID card. From now on, this same card will be acquired to access all storage boxes. Do not lend your card to anyone. Take great care in using it. If your card goes missing, report it immediately. Okay, so basically I can just open up storage boxes and doors and shit with this, which which is nice. Um, I could have swore that before all this, there is another door. It's right here. Okay. Oh, shit. What the hell what was that thing? fuck? It's literally the exact same hallway we go down multiple times as Leon. Alright. I know this game's about Nemesis. I know that... I remember this, dude. This is such deja vu. I know the odds of us running into Leon or Mr. X or whatever are like very slim to none because this is three and this is about Nemesis, but... I didn't stick around. I can still wish. I can still hope. Uh. Here we go. Hey! You there. Alright. 
Oh, it's one of the crawlies. Okay. Remember, everyone. Six foot social distancing. Okay. That means we're supposed to keep a distance. Alright. Let's see. Um, man, I'm really glad I got this mask on because there's a lot of a lot of germs and potential ways to get infected here. Alright. Let's see. Assault rifle. T, Locker room. You copy? Cap. There's something real nasty in here. I don't know what it is. Something nasty. All right. I'll take a look with the cameras. Watch your six. Okay. Locker room cap. So if I find a locker room cap, looks like it might be a code or something. So I can't go in there. However, I can go in here. All right. Oh, I'm just like fanboying so hard right now. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck. I just put myself in a goddamn co All right. Come on. All right. Y'all want to come at me like that? Wow, this machine gun really makes things a lot easier than just a pistol, huh? I guess I should have put more time in Resident Evil 2 to find the machine gun. If you guys don't know, there is a machine gun in Resident Evil, just like this one, that I never found. So, that goes to show right there that you should probably just take the initiative and the effort just to go find it, because it'll help you in the long run. Okay, I can use my key card for this. What is that? Oh, a scope. Oh, nice. I got a scope for my assault rifle. Okay, well, that'll definitely help a lot. Very nice. CQBR assault rifle. All right. Let's see what else I could find in here. Are you serious? Okay. Hold on. I need to I need to get some more distance between me and them. Okay. I got to rule out all these rooms. Got to make sure that Okay. Is there anything in here that I'm missing? Oh, wait, what is this? Damn it, man. I don't know what that would be. We found out the... We figured out the puzzle, the, the combination, in episode one. Like... Carlos, to speak like that. Copy that. Men's locker room. Hector, if you're reading this, I'm already dead. If you hear any noises coming from the locker, do not open it. Please. Break the shower room wall. Oh, so this is how we get through later on as Leon. Okay. Guess we'll be doing this the explodey way. Okay. Oh my god. Can, can we not be doing this? 99. Oh, 104, that's a battery. Okay, let's try that. Let's try one. 
Oh, four. Very nice. All right. Now we can get this. And now we can hopefully combine this, combine with that, with this. There we go. Now the detonator's working. All right. Let's see what else I can get while I'm here. While the getting's good. Assault rifle is 106. Grenade is 109. Yeah, see, Leon's not here because a shotgun was here before. So Leon's already in the building. I love this. I love the idea that I'm here doing this thing and Leon could have been here like 10 minutes ago. That's so cool to me. Alright, let's see what else. Alright. So we said we needed 106, 109. Okay, 106, 109, 106, 109, 106, 109. So, 106. I think I'm going to pass on the grenade anyways because I don't have I don't have room for that. So at least I know it's here though if I ever need it. All right. So now we got the detonator. Now we got the battery. Now we can properly make our way back up the stairs to go get Okay. I'm not invent I'm not I don't care about that. I don't really care about that, okay? I'm surprised that didn't actually freak me out a little bit. Alright, here we go. Copy that. Alright. Gotta move. I'd go a little bit further back than that, homie, but whatever. Number. Oh my god. Come on! Come on! No! I don't want to get bit! Alright. Huh, I wouldn't know. Alright, so. I don't know why everybody was stacked up at the shower room together. I'm not gonna ask any questions. Oh my god. can't possibly be the same one. That can't possibly be the same one. Can I please reload? Oh my god, can I please reload? Stop! Stop it! No, don't smile at me! You want some? Jesus, man! It would be so nice for one god darsh... One god darn second... I'm trying to remain monetized, even though I'm not monetized yet. That I could just not get bombarded with bullshit! Can I please look around? See, look, all this right here I would've missed. Because I would've run away like a little biatch. I'm sure given a lot of ammo with the assault rifle. I wish I got this much ammunition for the handgun as much as I do with the assault rifle. Jeez. All right, so uh, we're gonna continue to proceed this way. Let me give myself some of this. We have a first aid spray, which will give me full health if need be. All right. Nothing looks too suspicious in here yet. I got my handy dandy mask on just in case. Dr. Bard. All 
thank God. Do you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. No, negative. RPD's overrun, too. Then figure it out! You sure have... Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send... Send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. I like him already. All right. For somebody that wants their help, they're awfully, uh... Asshole-like-ish. You hear what he said? We can't turn him over to the company. That's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. And I'm gonna check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. <sighs> This'll take some time. Look around, see if you can find anything useful. Okay, since when did you become the boss? I was managing just fine before you came in all creepy-like with your assault rifle in the doorway, and I thought you were a nemesis for some weird reason. Alright. Got some first aid spray. Nothing to report in the storage box. Let's see, what's, what is this? Flash grenade. Those are ammunition. Files and... Oh, here we go. Let's see what this is. Assault rifle ammunition. All right. Yeah, what's up? Rail. Was anyone hurt? Jill? Oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Wait, what? Jill! Jill, what happened? Jill, come in! T, I gotta go. Do what you gotta. I'll take care of Bart. September 29th, 4.43 a.m. Star's office. Several minutes earlier, subway tunnels. All right. Well, we're going to find out what happens in the next episode. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Please leave a like on this video if you enjoyed. I'll have another episode out either tonight or tomorrow. I'm trying to get through this. We're going to get into Final Fantasy. Um, just a bunch of other games too and all that good stuff. Still got to finish Doom. So, with all that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, please put a like on it and share it. It really helps me out. It helps the channel out. It tells me that you guys want more videos from me. And if you're new, make sure to subscribe because it's free. And as always, it's been your boy, Buggy.